3.2 million debit cards may be vulnerable. Now most of the banks are popular and you know of them like SBI, ICICI Bank, Yes Bank, HDFC Bank, Axis Bank, etc. About 2.6 million MasterCard and Visa cards are affected. Now if you have one of these debit cards, chances are that your bank has already sent you a message asking you to change your ATM card pin as a precaution. Hope you've already done that. Today, Apple Inc. has invited media to an event on October 27th, where the company is expected to debut the new range of Mac computers. It's been a while since its oldest product category has gotten an update. We are expecting a redesigned MacBook Pro, a faster iMac and an updated MacBook Air. Le Eco's Le Pro 3 and Le S3 smartphone has been launched in San Francisco for the American market. In an event in US, the Chinese company unveiled the Le Eco Pro 3, which is priced at $399, that's approximately 26,700 rupees. The Le S3 costs $249, that is approximately 16,700 rupees. They also launched a 4K TV, that is the UMAX 85, that is priced at $4,999. That is approximately 3,34,000 rupees. Samsung Galaxy Note 7 is still being used by over a million people worldwide. A South Korean publication says that users have not returned their devices because of 1. They can't find a suitable replacement. 2. They like their device too much. And 3. They don't want to go through a replacement process. If you are one of those who haven't returned a Note 7, remember you are not just risking your life but also the people around you. Professor Stephen Hawking has opened an artificial intelligence centre in Britain's University, Cambridge. The centre aims to ensure that artificial intelligence is used to benefit humanity. Now the trust, the Liver Hume Centre for Future of Intelligence, that has funded the grant for this centre, will delve into AI apps. It will range from smart smartphones to robot surgeons and Terminator-style military droids. While opening the new centre, Stephen Hawking said he didn't really know what he can do with the research on AI. That's all on this edition of 360 Daily. I'm Devika Chitnis for Gadgets 360. See you tomorrow. If you like our video, don't forget to follow us on Twitter and Facebook on Gadgets 360.